down here in the block house just passing the Central Valley. I'm going to do a seat belt check. Roll it inverted, make sure nothing comes loose. Looking good. All right, G meters reset. Looking down into the East Valley there, clearing the area. No other aircraft in our way. All right, we get lined up, we'll climb up, and do a normal spin, starting at 5,000 feet. Normal spin is accomplished this time with full left rudder and full back elevator. Those controls will be held until the conclusion. Want to go opposite rudder and bring the stick forward. Pulling the throttle back now, slowing down, rudder elevator, around we go and we go. There's one and a half, two and a half, three and a half, four and a half, five and a half. Five and three quarters. Vertical down line this time like a competition spin. You don't necessarily have to do that yourself, just the way we fly them in competition. Okay, climb back up for our second set. When spinning to the left, the gyroscopic forces tend to push the propeller up. So first I'm going to get into a spin to the left, stabilize it, and then add throttle. And as I add throttle, that gyroscopic force will increase and the nose will rise up above the horizon. Well, not above the horizon, up towards the horizon. Recovery will be just to pull the throttle back and do a normal spin recovery. Slowing down now. Full left rudder. And stick back a little early there. There she goes. Okay, there's a half, there's one, one and a half, two. It's getting stabilized now. Add some throttle. Watch the horizon come up higher. Looking good. Pretty reasonable flat spin for the pits. Throttle back, opposite rudder, stick forward, and fly away from it. Climb back up for a third set. Each time I'm losing about 2,000 feet. Accelerated spins. Spinning to the right, the nose is held lower. That automatically is going to increase the, the rate of spin. Then by bringing the stick forward and feeding in some throttle, I can speed it up even more, really wrap it up. So spin to the right. Slow down, pull the nose up. Okay, full right rudder. Stick back. I'm going to get this into a stabilized spin and then add throttle. Look at it go around. There's one, there's two, there's three, there's four, there's five. Coming right around. Same recovery. Bring the stick all the way back, pull the throttle back to neutral, well, uh, throttle back to closed, and do a normal spin recovery. We can do these same spins inverted. I didn't today. Um, crossover spins, a variety of different things. Upset recovery, whatever you like. The Pitts S2B is an excellent platform for practicing all of these maneuvers.